I'm going to install this Dometic Mini Hecky style roof vent and I'm going to install that in here to both the beds. We can have a bit of light when we're in bed. So first things first, we measure the roof vent. Then we find the centre of the roof and we mark on the width of the roof vent. Then we're going to get the square and we'll draw the hole that we want to cut. Once we get that all accurate and we've checked it a couple of times, we're going to cut it out and we'll, what I use is the grinder. I just find it a lot easier than trying to get a jigsaw vibrating around on there. Nice little thin cut, it's fast, it doesn't put too much heat in anything. And we can just whip it out with the jigsaw for the last little bit of the cut, purely because I couldn't get in because of the beams. Okay, so that was the hole cut out. It didn't take very long. Um, we're just going to have to clean it up now and start a bit of preparation for fitting it down. So nip and get file and clean this all up. We have a little drop in the roof just here and then on the back we also have the same which is about 8 or 9 mil, maybe 10, I'm not sure. So I have some fascia board here which is like a high pressure plastic so I intend to use that and have, we can have the nice edge on the outside so it's something really good to bond to and that should give me a nice finish when I bomb that down on the outside and then on the inside we'll make a nice timber frame to clamp it to. So the fascia boards are really easy to cut with a Stanley knife. Just, trip, just score through it and it snaps off. And you just use the edge of the grinder just to put a little bit of shape around the end of it. And then when you come to stick it in, it'll go in nice, it'll all fit really well. So the adhesive I'm using here, it's basically a car body panel adhesive from the local car body factors. It works really well, goes off really quick, leaves a really nice finish. It's paintable, which will be good when I come to paint the outside of the van eventually. installed temporarily we've just got some blocks of wood clamping it in just so that it seals it down to the top and then when I get all the headlining in that'll um, sort that out so we've got our opening vent and sit like that Let's see if I can get from the outside Um, 
that's it. So we see you on the transport line. So it should be good.